ERA conference in three words, enjoyable, engaging, rewarding. Interesting, challenging and fun. Improvised, friendly, informative. Supportive, enthusiasm and fun. Meeting old friends, making new friends, going back with more knowledge. Very inspirational, uh, very motivational, but also, after today's session, quite unexpected. I know it's been said already, um, but it's brilliant to see so many of you here today at the 11th Employee Ownership Conference. This is our biggest audience yet. Uh, 630 of you registered for today. I guess I would describe you as our inquisitive explorers, our early adopters and our established experts. All here to share, learn and network together. These are business people that I can relate to. They're running successful companies, they're making decent profit, they're doing everything that normal companies do, but they've got this layer of employee ownership which makes it really interesting, very exciting and also um, for somebody that's now been doing it for a few years, really challenging. Um, for us it's just mixing with people who've, who've done it, who've been on the journey and perhaps we can get some more inspiration from them about where we're going. My plan is to get involved in as many of the different activities that are going on as possible. So there's lots of information giving sessions, so I'll be attending a variety of different seminars. But there are also um, networking sessions, uh, there's a gala dinner this evening. I'm going to take every opportunity I can to meet as many people as I possibly can. We're all going to different workshops, so that there are four of us here, and we can all take back different knowledge. Some of the highlights of the conference are, are certainly the gala dinner on the first evening, which gives people in employee and business the opportunity to realise that actually they're appreciated, and it allows them to celebrate the success they've had as businesses and as co-owners of those businesses. I feel incredibly proud and privileged to have been nominated and won the award two years to the, virtually to the day since we became an EO company and you can just see how EO companies can thrive once they're set free. I think especially a part of employee ownership is sharing your knowledge which is what we try to do especially with the new up and coming companies so I think that's a big part of it and what we'll continue to do which I think helps us take this position. I think, I think everyone works really hard and I think there's something about that recognition that isn't about money, it's about being recognised by your peers for all the work that's happening and that's really valuable. And it gives me really great pleasure to welcome to the stage the winner of this year's Employee Ownership Association Investment Award, uh, Condita and Cook and the co-founder Paul Cons. We tell, we tell them that business is no different than fantasy football. It's no different than Monopoly, okay? It's no different. I mean, there's nothing to be afraid of. You can learn it now. It's not going to change by the time you retire, by the time you leave the country. But if you can learn how to create value inside of your organization, the rewards are significant. The whole event, which is magnificent, you know, the Employee Ownership Association's done a phenomenal job. The number of companies competing for each award every year is going up and up and up. More and more companies are actually becoming employee-owned and finding that it really works. It works for the business and it works for the people.